everyone. I have not updated. We have left Washington State and we are now, where are we? North of Stockton, California. We're north of Stockton, California. We've been driving forever, but it's been a really good drive. So I'm not showing myself. It's too dark. It wouldn't work. But, um, uh, we came through some hellacious fog. That fog was so thick, you could cut it with a knife. So, and we even had the fog lights on, so. But just, you know, we're on the road, we're almost there. About another, let's see, it's five o'clock. I'm just gonna say five o'clock. It's about another four and a half hours. Four and a half, five hours, we get our destination. So, when I get to some light, I turn the camera on me because I found a new bang. Misty, I found a new bang, and we're gonna try it together. So, um, yeah, five hours and 23 minutes we'll be at our destination. But we'll probably stop before then. So I'll be checking in in a little while. Oh, okay, and when I left the house, my weight was 155.6. So when I get back, we're gonna see if I gained or if I lost anything. So, I'll be checking in in a little while. Okay, I thought I would turn you back on, and here's some of the fog. It's not as dense as it was before, but we do have some. Before, it was horrible. So, we are in Stockton, I believe. So, yep, we're getting closer and closer, but yep, it is foggy. Okay, it went from slightly foggy to very foggy. So this is what we've been dealing with off and on for about a couple hours, maybe? Yeah. This, this isn't too horrible. It's better, yeah. than, better than it was. Okay, yeah, but yeah, it's very foggy. And we've been in fog a lot worse than this on this trip, so. All right, I will check in a little later. Okay, can you see, say barely zero visibility? We can barely see anything. So we're being really safe out here. Okay, this fog is crazy. We're behind this big semi. It is all lit up. So it's just gonna light our way. Oh no, please don't go anywhere, Semi. We need your light. Oh. All right, check in in a bit. Okay, this is a quick update. I look like crap. We're in Fresno. Stopping for some gas. We're gonna feed puppy. But um, yeah, I know, I look like shit. We've been on the road for hours. I look like crap. But gas break, feed doggy. And we're back on it. We're in Fresno. We're hecka close. So I'll check in a little bit later. Okay, people, we are really moving. So we're almost to LA. We're getting ready to go through the grapevine. Get ready to go through the grapevine. And it won't be too much further. So um look at all the small guys. Ugh. All right. I will check in a little later. Okay, I am back. I know this is a horrible angle. You guys are actually sitting in my purse. So don't get too stressed out. I know it's junky in there. But I did want to do this bang test. Ooh, this is, is a bad angle. Sorry. Um, taste test. This, I haven't had this one. It is the candy apple crisp. So let's crack it open. Let's see. Oh God, it smells so good. Okay, here we go. I know I'm not doing as good as Misty, but here we go. This is good. It's not sour. I like it. I like this one. So. I'm gonna drink this down and hopefully soon we will be at our destination and I'll be checking in later. Bye guys. We made it to our destination, people. We're in Upland, but they had a severe um, 
windstorm and knocked out some of the power and a shit ton of trees. Oh my God. So I don't know if we're going to, we saw some and I didn't, silly me wasn't filming anything. Nope, nothing. So, but I'll take it out and film some more if we see anything down. But we passed a lot of huge trees that were down. Uprooted. Just uprooted. Just uprooted. It's, it was, it's amazing. So, I'll be back. Here, 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 right here. Oh, never mind. No, that's not it. But I'll be back. I'm <laughs> sorry, guys. I'll be back. Okay. We are here. Some of the damage. You can see all these trees are down. All this stuff. I'm not going to go past the yellow tape, but look at that. Oh my God. This is insane. Look at the size of that tree. I'm not going to go past the tape. I don't want to get in trouble. But let's see if we can make it bigger. Honey, it's a caution tape. It means you can't drive. I decided just, I, just I know that. I'm not going past it. Okay, look. Oh my gosh. It's quite the mess all over. But we'll be seeing more. So I'll be back because I'm ready to get to our destination spot to rest and shower i'm tired <laughs> good morning california skyline we made it and on sunday it is now tuesday I will get you guys caught up to speed as to what's been going on. Hi everyone, I am just sitting down to actually do a um, video and really give y'all guys a good update of um, what's going on with me. So, as you know, I am in Upland, California. I will be um, helping with my mother-in-law. She has dementia. Um, let's see. I think I've already said this. We got here on Sunday. Yeah, on Sunday. Um, she came home yesterday. Um, and today there was an x-ray appointment. So... We have a laundry list of appointments to make. Um, she will be having physical therapy. We're not sure of the schedule. A nurse will be coming to um, help with her for wound care because she did um, get bed, uh, bed sore. So we have a nurse that's going to come and help with that. I'm trying to think if there's someone else that's coming out. I think there's one more person that's coming out for something. Um, let's see. We have physical therapy. We have the nurse. I know it's one more person, but I'll think of it in a minute. Um, uh, I would say right now it's not super, super difficult. The only difficult part right now is her weight because she's a tall woman but she's very underweight she's not eating she has no appetite so getting her to eat is a big deal right now um and since she had the hip surgery getting her to use a walker something to help guide her walking is a big deal she doesn't want to do that um so that's kind of where we're at right now. Um, I will do my best to um, update um, as much as I can. And um, I'm still keto. Um, I'm still doing my thing. I um, actually ventured out today and I found my Planet Fitness. So... I did my workout this morning. I did not work out, just for the record, um, Monday. So what I did last week is I worked out every single day so that I would have an off day on Sunday. I worked out even on Saturday morning before we left to drive down to um, California. 
And the idea was I was going to work out on Monday, but because of all the driving, and this has normally never happened to me before, and we do long distance driving quite a bit, um, my knees actually swelled up, um, which was really odd. I've never really had that happen before, to have the knee swelling. So um, that was new for me. So my daughter was like, well, mom, maybe you should just give it one more day. Don't do anything on your knees. So um, that's the reason I didn't go and work out on a Monday or I would have started back up on Monday. So, yeah, but I've been on my still keto on my eating plan. Like I said, found the gym. I'm going to try to get on a schedule. Um, I had a really good schedule um, back home. So me trying to get on the schedule, um, I think what's hard for me is I'm not sure when the appointments are going to happen with all these different players. So to make sure I'm here for all of that and if there are doctor's appointments to adjust for that and all of that. Um, so we shall see, but the plan is for me to stay to some type of a workout schedule. Now, here's where I'm going to have to probably bend if I have to, is I detest working out in the evening, but if it comes to it and I have to do it, that's just what I'll have to do. I'll just have to suck it up and work out in the evening. So we shall see. Um, I don't have a definitive schedule. I'm hoping by the end of the week I can kind of map something out in my head and know who all the players are and they can give me a schedule of what days they're going to be here and at what time and all that stuff. So. Uh, yeah, that's about all the update I have because that's all the information I have at the moment. Um, I'm trying to think if there's anything else. I do have my gunner here with me. He's going to be with me the two months. So, um, yeah, that's about it. Um, I'm trying to not make this video be so long just to give you an update more or less of where I'm at. Um, I will start tomorrow doing the um, kind of more food vlogs of what I'm eating and all that stuff. Um, I was planning on trying to do that today. Today got away from me. Like I said, we had to go do x-rays. And then there were family members that came to visit my mother-in-law. So things were just, it was just constantly busy in the house today. So... Um, I was not able to do that, and I'm working, so I'm still working. Um, yeah, so that is just kind of my update. Um, I did talk to some of the family members, but um, my thought is I would incorporate some of what I'm doing into some of my vlogs, not every single day. It may be an update on what it is like to care for someone that has dementia. Um, so um, stay tuned for that, I guess. And I'm sorry, um, I'm just a little tired. It's been a long day and I'm just a little bit drained, so I am going to close this out. I did want to give you some type of an update as to my status and what's going on. So I do want to thank you for following me. I am going to definitely be back. Um, tomorrow, I will try to get up um, and do more of my regular vlogging. So I will be... Um, it's quite possible my schedule is going to change with the vlogs too. So I'm going to try to get this video out today because it's a compilation of driving down and all of that stuff. So I will try to get that out today and then maybe do maybe a Wednesday, Thursday and try to get back on schedule with Saturday. We'll see. So I'm going to stop rambling and get this video up. And thank you guys so much for watching. And I will be back in a few days. Mwah. Oh,